APC taunt Governor Obaseki for getting bored by an angry crowd. The incumbent governor of Edo State, Governor Godwin Obaseki, has been surrounded by lots of controversy in recent months. The inception of his political brouhaha was marked by the power tussle between him and his predecessor, Comrade Adams Oshomole. The disagreement and fracas between the two members of the All Progressive Congress have lingered on for months. The exact cause of their feud is still vague to the masses. Whether it's because Governor Obaseki refused to worship a master or because he breached an agreement, it's yet to be disclosed. The feud had eventually led to the resignation of Governor Obaseki from All Progressive Congress APC and his official joining of the rival People Democratic Party. Since Edo State's gubernatorial election is impending to take place in September, no one will deny that Governor Obaseki's party switch will not take a toll from him. He is surely not getting an easy win for the governorship race. Two major things are involved. He will lose supporters and will gain supporters as well. But the most important thing is the ratio of the loss to the gain. The All Progressive Congress APC support group through their Twitter handle had taunted the embattled governor for being disrespected and abased by the crowd. It was reported that the governor had an appointment with the Oba of Benin in his palace, but was held up at the entrance by the crowd who hauled bad comments at him, according to their Twitter posts. The PDP Hoover candidate in Edo State, Mr. Godwin Obaseki, was left deflated and completely disgraced at the palace of the Oba of Benin after his convoy was blocked by angry residents numbering in thousands who bored and disgraced the governor calling him a thief. Well, this is not Nigerian, and also this is Nigerian. Such a scenario is new to no one, especially when election is around the corner. But could it be that the large crowd we are planted by the opposition? Everything is possible. Very, very possible. Thank you for listening to this news. Very, very possible, my viewers. Nothing is impossible. Everything is possible. Sure possible. Thank you for listening to this news. My viewers, see, I will tell you something. Eh? After telling you this, you go and make your findings. See, there is nothing, there is nothing Oshomole and his faction can do to Godwin Obaseki. You understand what I'm saying? Godwin Obaseki has already taken the lead. He has taken the lead and he has taken it. APC will only try but I will tell you the truth that they cannot defeat Obaseki. See, PDP has has given themselves has given themselves a, a blessing already. They have given themselves the, the blessing of God is already on PDP for having given Obaseki the ticket to contest. See. APC started failing the day they kicked Obaseki out of APC, Connelly. 
And that is one of the greatest mistakes that Oshomole knows that he has made. That is why he is ready to do everything humanly possible to see that he doesn't fail. Because he knows what APC is going to do to him. If APC DL loses a two states to PDP, he knows what the party is going to do to him. Before the party will allow him to leave to another party, they will make sure that they drill, they drill him completely. They drill him completely. Financially, they will drill him. Materially, he will be drilled. Economically, he will be drilled. And he will be sent back to how he used to be. Huh. See, Oshomole and his faction should keep trying. But one thing for sure is that a two state is already for PDP. It used to be for APC, but this time around, it has been given to PDP. You go and market. You go and market. You will say that I said this to you. You will say that I said this to you because there is nothing, there is nothing APC is going to do. Is going to do to PDP. As far as this September 19th, Edo gubernatorial election is concerned. I'm telling you the truth. See, so many things has happened. So many, see, this this period, though, was a tempting period for, for Baseki. But because God actually wants him to still rule the second time, that is why God made it possible for PDP to issue him a ticket. If PDP doesn't want to issue Obaseki a ticket to go in for second time, so for second time, they will God, God, God would have made it possible for them not to issue to him. But because God wants him to to still rule a do state for the second time, that is why God made it possible. You understand? That's why God made it possible. But people are not seeing it. Seeing it from that direction. Okay, see, look at. See, let me tell you something. It is very possible that those people that were abusing Ob uh, Obaseki at the gates of the Oba were actually planted there. They were planted there. You understand? They were planted there. No doubt. You're getting it. So, if they were not planted, then definitely it will be the few that 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 we that we act that 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 were actually aware of the coming of Obaseki to the Oba Palace that day. So they decided to come there, wait, see. And see how to disgrace themselves saying that they want to disgrace Obaseki. Oh, but my brother, let me tell you the truth. All these things are political propaganda. Nothing is going to happen to Obaseki's um, election on, the, on, 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 on September 19. Obaseki is going to that election ground and is, go, is coming out successfully. Do you understand? All right? The only my only advice for him is that he should remain absolute, focused. He should carry his God along. Then he should use his his position as an incumbent governor to redeploy massive security to make sure they man every checkpoint, every checkpoint on that day. Most especially the communities, because I am having this feeling that something is in fact atrocities is going to be is going to take place on that day. So it should not give chance or room to that. You understand? So my viewers, I don't know what your comments concerning this may be, but please don't hesitate to leave them behind. Click on the subscription button as well as bell button to get updated whenever you upload any new videos. Thank you.